Welcome to another review in the Retro Kid Show thing. Today I'm going to be reviewing a game this time. It's Bionic Commando. Okay then, let's just start. Yay! Now I'm going. I'm playing this with the um, NES Advantage, so please forgive me if I totally suck. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, on to the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, the graphics are really nice on the NES, in my opinion. They they look quite nice for NES. Uh, yeah. I got turbo here so I can blast and double shot. Yeah, well, um, the controls are you press the A button to shoot your grappling arm. Um, you just press it once to shoot at an angle and you can pull yourself up when shooting at an angle by holding the A button. Um, you can also shoot up and forward and you can crouch and shoot your gun. But really, the entire point of this game is to be like a ninja, kind of. Uh, it's quite a well-made game. Um, I really don't have much gripes, it's just... Uh, the, um, I kind of have a problem with the fact that it takes so many health improver thingies to actually get some health. And it, it can get a bit challenging at the time, but that's kind of basically what NES games are all about, being hard as balls. Um... Dang it, I missed that. Also, I kind of find a problem with the fact that you fall straight down and can't control your falls. I mean, one could argue that that's supposed to, uh, supposed to be re realistic, but really, in reality, you can, like, kind of control your falls. So, at least they could have given us a little bit of controlling of our falls. Yeah, um, so, here's another guy. I'm going to jump down. Dismissing all horrifying odds or something, I don't know. Um, seriously, these graphics look pretty nice. I'm not very good, so I'm not going to get very far in this. I mean, I'm not like super ultra master reviewer. And I'm also using an NES advantage, so... And I'm not exactly used to the whole arcade experience kind of thing. And yeah, um... The good things about this game... Well, the controls are very fluent. Uh, you can your character moves really quickly. It's really I, I really like the whole stealth style put into it. It's it's really well pulled off. Um, uh, um, yeah. Basically, I I think I'm gonna give this game say uh, hmm, hmm, well. I guess I'll give it an 8 out of a 10. It has its problems, but all around it's a great game and really fun to pick up if you're gonna own an NES or, or a Nintendo clone or something like that. Well, uh, thanks for watching my review and I recommend this game. Whoops.